Hey loves and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is jam packed with plenty of cleaning motivation. I even made a to do list so I could stay on task and do everything I needed to do in this short period of time. This is a nap time clean with me meaning that Caleb was taking his nap which allowed me a good hour to clean everything I needed to get cleaned. If you are new here, my name is Rogina. I am a wife, a full-time working boy mom, and I like to film cleaning videos on top of all of that. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you like it and me enough to hit that subscribe button down below. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. Also, don't forget to comment and hit that thumbs up button so I know that you like this type of content. We are starting in the kids bathroom i actually had just cleaned my bathroom and i needed to mop it which meant i needed to mop theirs which also meant if i was going to mop it i might as well clean it On my knees, what's in it for me? I'm using Clorox bathroom cleaner to clean the toilet and I am spraying all around the inside and the outside and around the floor. Hashtag boy mom.
I usually use Fabuloso to mop the bathrooms in the kitchen, but today I decided to go ahead and use bleach and done to mop. I just wanted to make sure the floor was disinfected. I had dyed my hair the night before and y'all hair dye was everywhere and I thought I was really careful but it was I guess splattering as I was combing it through my hair so I decided to spray those spots with some bleach to try to get it up. And there goes all of the dirty mop water. It's not as bad as the kitchen, but it's still pretty gross. Y'all look at me checking things off my to-do list. And now on to the laundry. I had about five loads, I believe. Two were mine and then the rest were the kids and I think some towels. So no, I did not fold all of that stuff while Caleb was asleep. It was just, oh gosh, you'll see later on. <laughs> oh, I was over that laundry. I was so over it. Surprise. Oh. I thought you'd always be mine. Oh, yeah. 
The laundry just keeps going and going and going. I really thought we had it covered. Was gonna patch up all the scars, but we smashed up all the parts. Oh, no, no, no. Always knew that you were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. I was trying to watch Umbrella Academy while I was folding and putting away clothes. I think I got to like one or two episodes. I need to actually go back and watch the rest. I haven't been able to watch a lot of Netflix like I was before just because school has started back and um, of course I'm still working. So just trying to get everybody back on schedule. So I will be um, going ahead and finishing this show. I will say the episodes that I did watch, I did enjoy. So I definitely will be watching the rest.
still have the kids clothes down here on the floor to fold. I'm not gonna fold them today cause I'm over it. Um, but I just have like some towels and stuff and some blankets and some sheets. And then I'm going to vacuum and then I'm going to sit down because Caleb is sleeping. It's his nap time and he's been sleeping the entire time I've been doing this. Um, so I'm gonna fold these up and then I'm gonna vacuum and the rest of these clothes they're gonna be left for tomorrow. I'm over like folding and putting away laundry already. And plus I still have another load of clothes. Um, I think Christian and Caleb's clothes in the washing machine. I'm not, not in the washing machine, in the dryer. Now that I still have to fold. So I just knock all of that out tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna back in this room, pick up everything off the floor and I'm gonna be done. to have the time but when it's hard you just grow cold up we should be good but we keep lighting fires the words you be cause we're scared of the silence we should be good but we keep lighting fires fires around ourselves we should be good but we keep lighting fires the words you be cause we're scared of the silence we should be good but we keep lighting fires fires around ourselves it's deja vu Say we're done, say it's over Shouldn't be coming back But somehow we connect Acting drunk even though we're sober We should be good, but we keep lighting fires The words you keep, cause we're scared of the silence We should be good, but we keep lighting fires Fires around ourselves We should be good, but we keep lighting fires The words you keep, cause we're scared of the Silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires, fires round ourselves. It's deja vu. Now I'm just going to go ahead and pick everything off of the floor so I can vacuum. I'm putting down some carpet fresh. Go pick some up at Dollar Tree. Um, and then I'm going to just vacuum with my Dyson. Oh, someone asked me, did I still recommend this vacuum? Okay. Oh, I know. I know y'all love Dyson. I know you love it. But I would not purchase another Dyson vacuum. And here is why. Um... They have great suction, yes, but they are not made very durable. Um, the top of this, where I, I'm not sure if you can see like the little purple part, it's a filter in there and that part has broken off. I have to tape it down. Um, the back of the canister, you see where the canister just opened and all the stuff spilled out. That's because the clip is broken. Now, 
those things are broken because this vacuum is so top heavy and if you you can't stand it up by itself you have to lean it up against something or lay it flat on the floor so sometimes when I lean it up against the wall I'm thinking it's secure and it's not going to slide and then as soon as I step away it slides and hits the floor so no I would not pay this type of money for a vacuum I'm actually thinking about getting a uh, commercial vacuum for my upstairs area since it's so much carpet and just keeping this one downstairs So I am done and Caleb just woke up. So I'm about to get him out of the crib. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.